subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get latest updates hello friends in this video i am going to unbox and review brother tcpt 300 multifunction intact printer brother is a japanese company and the printer is manufactured in philippines they provided a printer cover so that's a good thing Here is the user manual and CD for driver installation. This is 3 pin power cable. What's inside the box? Let's see. Uh, open name. Uh, oh, this is black ink. It contains 180 ml of ink and promises to print up to 6000 pages. And this coloring contains 48 ml of ink and it promises to print up to 5000 pages. This is the USB cable to connect the printer with the computer. Let me take the printer out from the box and then I will show you how to fill the ink tank and how to connect the USB cable. The look and feel of the printer is very good and here it shows the claims again that the black ink will print up to 6000 pages and color ink will print up to 5000 pages and here is some troubleshooting tips. Here is the ink tank so you will be able to see the ink level from outside. This is our paper tray. Uh, you can load up to 100 papers inside it and this is the output tray and this is our scanner portion you can scan up to a port size pages here the brother scan has an amazing feature the lead height can be adjusted so that you can scan boots this is an amazing feature so let's connect the USB cable, we have to open the scanner cover up. Here are some tips for how to remove paper jam. That's good. Now I am connecting the USB cable. Here is another good design feature. There is a group and we have to put the cable through the group so that it doesn't hamper the other functions. Thumbs up rather. So let's fill the ink. Here the ink tank uh, is inclined in 45 degree angle. So while putting the ink in the ink tank, we won't spill any ink. This is another good design feature of brother printer. Now I'm taking out the black ink. First open the cork and then you know, there is a seal. You have to carefully remove the seal. Yeah. Now put the cap on and gently squeeze the bottle to pour the ink. After filling up all the ink tanks, now I am going to powering on the printer for the first time. The printer will take some time to soak the ink into the ink cartridge and cleaning the cartridge head. So give the printer some time. In the meantime, I am going to load some paper in the paper tray. You can actually take out the paper tray out of the printer. So here yeah, I have taken out the paper tray and loaded some paper. With these guides, you can adjust the page sizes. The paper tray is a good feature at the same time it is also a bad feature. If you are trying to print on the both side of the pages, in that case you have to take the tray out and then again load the 
printed page in the tray but if you could fit the printed page from outside it would be a great advantage now printer is asking for loading paper tray so i am going to insert the paper tray and print a test page so i am going to press the color start button because i want to test both color and black ink if you press the only white button it will only print black and white pages so the printer is now printing a page let's see here is our test printing page i think the quality is okay but the color is not deep enough so i think i have to print another two or three pages to make the color deep enough now review uh, considering all its design aspects and functionality i think this is a good printer at this budget segment epson is also good if you are trying to print pictures on hot paper then epson is the only choice because i have tried auto printing in this printer but the color depth is not as good as epson but its printing cost per page is very low than other printers plus it prints very fast so if you print documents frequently then this is the best choice but if you are trying to print images in that case you should go for epson so that's it friends i think you find this video useful thank you for watching my video and please subscribe to my channel for future updates have a great day